this facility that we're in, where we're looking at, where we're hosting this event today, it's based in the in the port of Deppen, specifically in Maidenhof. So I'm more than grateful to welcome here into FFS 10 Terminal Sorting Function, where the company will be announcing a big investment of 350 million to the port of Deppen. As a company, indigenous company, that is trying its best, employing an enormous amount of people, making a, you know, a good contribution to the economy of this country, doing it with competence, it is my pleasure and privilege to be on this grounds today and basically you know, uh, welcoming all of you and saying this is the beginning of many more of these kinds of things to come. It's a great blessing that we can actually stand here today, announce a good news project, one that's good for the South African economy, the Durban economy, the port of Durban, and our co local construction industry, which so desperately needs it. Yeah, so we are a, a level one um, black owned uh, company. And I think it's very important that this port sees transformation. And this is real investment by a black owned company in the port, um, you know, really contributing to the whole transformation agenda. Our relationship with the port has been fantastic. TNP have been very supportive of this project. Um, they've gone out of their way to accommodate us, to um, uh, expedite planning approvals and things like that. And so, yeah, we've got a really rela a good relationship with um, Mpumi and her team. Today is a watershed moment, not just for our company FFS, uh, but also just for the industry. And, and, and I think that uh, for Transnet and TNPA in particular, because the perception in the market is that uh, there's no movement, there's just words, and that people are extremely verbose and garrulous on talking about stuff without doing stuff. So I, I, I hope that today signifies um, you know, a company that actually makes a move, that actually does sword turning uh, for an event that is going to be an eventuality that actually comes to fruition. And we're not just talking about stuff that's going to come into fruition for the sake of fruition. We're also talking stuff, stuff that's going to make an impact, you know, in this industry. Because, you know, the molecule that we deal with actually, um, you know, drives the economy, is the backbone of the economy. So when Transnet and TNPA is actually um, encouraging these kinds of initiatives, I think it's encouraging for us as business people, uh, you know, to to invest in this economy. And I I feel very good about today. And I think it's a beacon of hope for for everyone in in this space and in the economy. I am defining this event as a game changer in the port of Durban. This is the first one, and more of these sort turning events are going to be coming very soon. We are open for business. We're really excited. We are looking forward into having an impact to the economy of our country and the economy of this region and the economy of this city, a Tequenio municipality. We're looking forward to the jobs that are going to be created here. We're looking forward to the first ship that is going to be calling here, Karen Cargo, that is going to be coming to this facility. Thank you. We acquired this business, FFS Tank Terminals, formerly OTGC, um, back in May this year. But we'd already identified that this site had huge potential in terms of building a, a, a new terminal. And, uh, you know, the, with the closure of the SA refineries over the last couple of years, um, there's a huge demand for petroleum products such as bitumen and base oil, fuel oils, um, being imported into the country. And, uh, you know, we. We've spoken to a lot of customers and um, we finally managed to uh, agree to a, a, a deal with a company called Rubus Asphalt South Africa. They won, Rubus is one of the largest um, importers of bitumen throughout the world. And so we're going to build three uh, tanks for them, total capacity 7,500 cubes. And that's phase one of our new <coughs> tank terminal development. Um, the overall development that we've planned here is in total about 26,500 cubic meters. Uh, phase two will commence next year and should be finished by November 2024. And yeah, we believe the total investment will be in the region of around 350 million rand. Yeah, we really do uh, hope that once, well, we know that once this is uh, com uh, fully commissioned, um, 
we will be importing bitumen, which is an absolute key component for the whole road construction industry and other products such as base oils for lubricating oils, for the for motor engines, absolutely key for this country to move forward.